Good morning, family. Peace and blessings from Ray Imperial. Last to the true keepers of the flame of Imperial Flame Kennels. I'm out here this morning with the fat, fat dog. Uh, I believe today is... Don't start me to lie, y'all. I'm terrible with days and dates, but it's roughly Wednesday, I want to say. Wednesday or Thursday, June 22nd, maybe 20, something like that, 21st, 22nd, somewhere around there. So, uh, it is currently, hold on, I'm going to actually check this for y'all. Wait, stay. Good, stay, baby. Anyway, so I believe it's Thursday, June 22nd, if I'm not mistaken, roughly about 5 a.m. in the morning. I'm out here with the fat, fat dog. Um, just wanted to talk a little bit about her as a dog, um, you know, all around, you know, how she stacks up according to breed standards, um, in terms of temperament expectations of the family of dogs that she comes from etc uh, as we can see she's kind of attentive she's kind of on her prowl thing but uh, she's a very very prey driven dog um, as we saw in the short that I released you know uh, that short, uh, I believe I called it Fat Fat Place Tag with Bambi or something like that. Uh, she definitely chases larger game, you know, at the drop of a hat. You know, she's not the type of dog to see larger game and think like, oh, do I go after it? No, she's going to automatically head in that direction. Um, in addition, in the house, she is the par excellence house dog. Like, she, her, her mannerisms and demeanor in the house is, I mean, this dog is perfect. This dog is perfect. Only thing you got to watch her, um, you know, like, she will hit any extra food that's laying, on, laying around, especially if you drop some chips on the ground, stuff like that, you know. Yeah, yeah, she will definitely. But, I mean, like, what dog ain't? You know what I mean? Like, that's, that's par for the course. So... In terms of the old family red nosed dogs, uh, as a, you know, a branch of the American Pit Bull Terrier, they're known for their stable temperament. Uh, and she is definitely a very stable temperamented dog. You know, you don't necessarily get a whole lot of, you know, just out of the gate fire. I want to tear up every dog I see from the old family red nosed lines. Um, now you will have, you know, that uh, that tendency to want to dominate and be the alpha and so forth and so on. That's that that's in the breed. Um, so you get that in your old family red nosed dogs. You get that in her. Uh, she's definitely one of those. Uh, I don't know. She she she'll tolerate other dogs, but. Not to the extent where you know it's like uh, we gonna be buddy buddy. She's she's not that she's not that type of type of dog. Um, even with the males, she'll tolerate them when she's in season. But that's a you know that's about as far as that goes. 